What's up everybody? I am Georgia Dodd here with Georgia Media Agency and today we have the pleasure of speaking with and interviewing Toons. What's up Toons? How you doing? What's up? What's up? What's up? Okay, so definitely love to see your face. You know you are one of the most recent winners of the artist showcase that Georgia Media Agency put on. So how did you feel when you found out that you won? I was excited. I couldn't believe it. Really. Why couldn't you believe it? Because that was my first time running the showcase. Okay, cool. So, like, just kind of go backwards. Think about what was going through your mind when you performed. Like, how do you feel about that performance? Like, I was, uh, I was excited to see everybody was vibing with it. And then I was like, main, my main thing in my head was to like get them to turn up. Mm -hmm. So. Yeah, you did that. Yeah. You definitely did that. So I can definitely say like crowd participation, all of that is very important. You can have a smash hit, but if nobody's rocking with you in the crowd, it really ain't that. It's not that important. So you're from Savannah, Georgia, right? Yeah, Savannah. Okay, cool. So you're from Savannah. You do music. So how long have you been rapping professionally, or have how, how long have you been taking this seriously? I just started taking it serious like two years ago. Mm -hmm. But I've been rapping since like not really rapping, rapping, but. I came into it like since I was like eight. So you just recently had a performance with Street X at the Who Got the Juice showcase. So how was that? That was exciting too. Like it was my first time being like a little in a little club vibe. Mm -hmm. So it was like I was like shocked seeing what was going on, but mm -hmm. I was like still like game time. That's what I was thinking about. And this is recently. Yeah. It okay. was like a week after I did the showcase with them. Okay, so you just you just do your thing. You got your little tour going on. <laughs> okay, so with Grind Gang, you have an EP. It's a group effort it's a group collaboration so kind of just talk about the grind game ep that's releasing soon uh grind game uh back to the trail it's gonna be a little ep it's gonna be just like seven songs and it's me and my brothers or i call them brothers yeah and it's gonna be like taking you back to the old south like how the music used to be yeah okay so who all is on that project uh, me my brother privy c Port rocky and gets the kid okay cool so you have another project. You have a couple of mixtapes coming out. You're just doing yeah. like a back-to-back -back series of mixtapes. So, with that being said, your next mixtape or your other mixtape that you mentioned was Give Me a Minute. So, what was the purpose of that? Like, what can we expect from that mixtape? It's going to be like, I love Wayne Dead, sorry for the wait. It's going to be like a mixtape before the mixtape. So, Lil Wayne, that's definitely somebody who inspires your music, right? Yeah, favorite rapper. So, you're doing like more like freestyle, kind of how he did his music back when everybody was saying that's the real Wayne. So how do you feel about the, the new Wayne technically and the old Wayne? Or you think it's the same music? I mean, I like the old music better too, but I know if he really wanted to, he could still do what he been doing. Right. So. I agree with that, I agree with that. So, Tuned and Reloaded. So what is that all about? I been had a my first mixtape was called Tuned In, but I didn't really like how it sounded, the quality and that. Mm -hmm. when I first really, really started rapping. And this one gonna be like some of the old songs from there but better quality sound in LA. There's gonna be no, some new songs. So now that you can listen to your older music and listen to now and you see the difference in quality, do you definitely think now is you know really important for artists to have quality studio time? Just the, Cause it really makes a difference. So how do you feel about when you hear a certain song, you know it needs something like, how do you feel about that? I mean, like you should want the best out if you wanna put your stuff out. You shouldn't want nobody to be like, oh, I don't like that or it could have been better. You should be like, you should be your own biggest critic to me. Right. So with that being said, Early Grind Music Group, can you elaborate on, on that music group? Uh, early Grind Music Group, that's me and my brothers again, c Park Rocky, Privy, me and Guess the Kid. Like Early Grind Music Group, the name came from us being young and we grinding. Like it was really Early Grind Gang, Early Grind Gods. And we trying to be the best, of, best at the best we trying to be the best ones doing it. Basically, that's why we put the guys in it. So how did y'all meet? Uh, school, we just came together. And all of us wanted the same thing, so we came together and started pursuing our dream. So out of all of you all, like, who started rapping first? Or who took it more like, oh, I'm, this is really what I want to do, like, out of all of y'all? I don't know, I can't. You can't, can't really, really think about it? Uh, but all of y'all equally, y'all put more effort into y'all music and y'all careers now, right? Yeah. Okay, cool. So, my last question to you is, where do you see yourself musically in the next year? I see me uh, at least more out there, like, more well-known, rather than just in my city or just surrounding city. I'm going to be, like, probably, like, across the, sta across the states, I see myself. So, how are you going to get to that level? A lot of people, they talk about the way they see themselves, but what actions are you going to put forth in order to get to those those milestones. 
keep traveling, keep doing features, I'm trying to promote my uh, music, like, you know, verbally. So I'm gonna just keep grinding. Okay, cool. So what's your social media? How can people connect with you? My Instagram is underscore underscore tunes, T-U-N-E-Z. Twitter is grind got tunes. Okay, cool. Thank you. This is Tunes with Georgia Media Agency. I am your favorite on-air personality, Georgia Doll, signing off. Thank you so much, Tunes.